Distillation and atmospheric irrigation are basic principles that have guided the research of Silver Salga. His innovation, which is named the Tensis system, will be able to draw rain from the atmosphere at any time, anywhere in the world. At a time when severe drought has plagued most parts of Africa, the Bukinabe's invention could potentially save many lives. It's a miniaturized way. It will be assumed that the water contained in this container is the ocean surface, heated at all times by the sun and leaving water vapor escaping. Our role will be simply to attract water vapor through air channels that are molecules up to the height of the area or country where we want it to rain. It is then necessary to send capacitor elements of these vapors called aerosols. It can be simply salt or any other element. The condensed vapor in droplets of water will then produce rains. So whatever the season, we can have rains with this system. Salva began working on the tensor system in 2016. He feels that his innovation is an effective way of combating the adverse effects of global warming. The TENSIS system can contribute greatly to the fight against global warming because it would allow to regreen the arid lands, to produce forest, to protect the ozone layer, to counter global warming. Beyond that, glaciers can also be protected since it will be possible to counter indirectly the rise of the Earth's temperature. With a bachelor's degree in geography, the young innovator aims to create a large multidisciplinary research lab. However, the Bukinabe government is yet to recognize and support his innovation, something he feels the government should invest in when it comes to research and development. Talents are an incomparable locomotive for development. If we neglect them, we kill the development of the country. Currently, this is particularly true in Burkina Faso and more generally in Africa, where creativity, innovation and talent are not encouraged. That is the major challenge I would like to see corrected because if we invest in this sector, Africa will certainly develop. The cost of realizing the tensor system amounts to billions of dollars. But with the appropriate funding, Salga's project could be beneficial to arid and semi-arid regions across Africa. Terry Wangari, CGTN.